In this video, we'll be looking into the important questions of analysis and design of algorithm subject of subject code BCS401. This is for the 22 scheme uh, students, okay, for the fourth sem. So, starting from the first module, uh, first we have is what is an algorithm, properties of algorithm, and explain algorithmic design and analysis. Uh, next we have is the general plan for uh, recursive or non-recursive. Be it recursive or non-recursive, the five steps remain same here. You should write the same five steps, okay? Along with that, they can ask an example also. It could be factorial example or a maximum element or uh, there are many uh, examples ahead. Then we have asymptotic notation. Asymptotic notation, big O notation, sigma, um, omega notation, all those questions would be asked. So make sure that you cover all these topics properly. So uh, here are my first first module notes and uh, I have uploaded module wise uh, like videos for each and every each and every module each and every topic so you can go through my playlist so this is the playlist and I have tried covering all the important topics each topic of uh, each module in uh, three to four uh, videos so, okay so each module is covered in three to four videos so make sure you watch all these videos I have explained it with example analysis everything from exam perspective okay so next moving on we have sequential search what is the best case worst case and average case efficiency then we have this theorem this theorem is a must it has asked for 10 marks okay so make sure that you understand this theorem properly then we have what are the fundamentals of algorithmic problem solving a flow chart so this is again an important question then we come to selection sort bubble sort so in out of these two one could be asked and analysis should be written, algorithm should be written, and a program would be a problem would be there. Okay, so here is the 2021 scheme paper. So if you see the most of the questions which I have taken are from this paper itself. Uh, along with that, I have also analyzed the previous year question papers and I have noted down the important questions. So so this is about uh, our first module. Moving on to the second module. Second module, we have knapsack or uh, traveling salesman problem using exhaustive search. Again, knapsack and traveling salesman problem, uh, this is a pretty easy topic. Like using exhaustive search, how will you perform the traversal? And in knapsack problem, how will you do it? You'll consider all the items, all the combinations, and then derive one particular item or a set of items which will have maximum profit. So this was about the first exhaustive search topic. Then we have concept of divide and conquer, right recursive algorithm to perform binary search for list of elements. Yeah. Again, uh, intro part of divide and conquer, and then we have to write the algorithm for binary search. And uh, if example is asked, uh, if example is asked, we can write the example also. Next, we have the most important thing in second module that is the master theorem and substitution method problems. So master theorem substitution method problems are very important. Here um, in the video, I have tried covering all the possible questions. So I've solved nearly nine to 10 problems for uh, master's theorem and three problems for uh, substitution method. So any question in exam would be from this only. So make sure you watch the video properly, okay. Next moving on further, we have merge sort or quick sort. So yeah, merge sort or quick sort is again a complex topic. So uh, if you know how to write the algorithm properly, how to perform the analysis and how to, you know, uh, give for given an, give an example, how to perform the operation, then uh, it will be easy. So out of these two, one could be asked. So these are the values, uh, these are the questions which were asked in the last time paper. So I have written it here. Then we have multiplication of large number and sessions multiplication. This topic is new because it was not there in previous year papers. So out of these two, one could be asked. Again, theory is there and uh, with an example, you can explain both. Then you have insertion sort problem or topological sort problem. Insertion sort problem is again a pretty simple topic and topological sort is again very easy to understand in that simple problems would be there. So if you see here, we have the insertion sort algorithm, then uh, example. So it is again very easy to solve. Then in topological sort, we have uh, the sorting, the normal sorting, right? topological sort we have the normal sorting so this uh, this this diagram would be given and we have to sort it using uh, the order okay next moving on further coming to the third module we have problems on avl tree and 2 3 tree so again this is a new topic so they can be like what are avl trees what is 2 3 tree uh, explain it with an example on the field 
next coming to the second problem that is the heap sort problem so heap sort problem again there are two steps here first step is creation of heap and then deletion of the uh, elements from the heap then we are sorting by counting sorting by counting was asked in the last time paper so yeah this is again a important question then we have the horsepool algorithm for string matching so this question was asked in the last time paper so i have written it down here moving on to the fourth module we have uh, the dp introduction to dynamic programming and out of that uh, three examples are there okay so in those three examples any one could be asked first one is the coin row problem or we have the uh, change making problem or the robot coin collecting robot problem so out of these three one could be asked okay so moving on further next we have is the knapsack problem so again knapsack problem this is a standard question which is usually asked so these there are two questions so first one is this and the second one is this so next we have washel problem uh, washel algorithm either they can give uh, in the adjacency matrix way or they can give a graph so however it's given this is a standard question which is asked always okay next in floyd's algorithm again algorithm plus problem so this question was given the last time and if you look at the standard problem here they have just inserted e here that's it but then this is the standard question these this is also a standard question so i have solved all these questions in my uh, youtube video so make sure you cover the playlist properly coming to prince algorithm they can ask uh, definition of uh, minimum span entry and then this question is a standard question again coming to digistrust algorithm and problem this is a standard question which needs to be solved next kriskel's algorithm uh, and problem kriskel's uh, kriskel's method is pretty easy to solve and you can easily score marks if if crystals is present in exam in question paper i would suggest you to write this and not go for any other method suppose if you are uh, solving it for washel or floyd with even with a slightest mistake you, your entire calculation can go wrong right i hope you know i hope you know about it so i would suggest you to solve the crystals method over any of the other uh, techniques so if you see here it is very easy i have just arranged in Uh, increasing order and then i selected the ones which uh, do not form cyclic uh, graph right moving on further huffman's code this is a standard question again so we have to encode for a given character and decode a set of numbers moving on to the fifth module fifth module uh, we have it will be mostly theory because there are two chapters here first chapter uh, that will be uh, some of subset question would be there introduction of backtracking algorithm could be asked then assignment problem this is a must question um standard question then we have n queens problem again uh, depicting the n queens drawing all those uh, boxes and solving it next we have the knapsack problem knapsack problem again uh, we make use of the dynamic uh, approach here for solving the knapsack problem uh, sorry optimization uh, problem here we make use of the upper bound value and all of this this calculation part then coming to the tsp problem again tsp problem also we have we make use of the calculations initial uh, lower bound upper bound all those things state space we, we solve these using state space tree then definition of deterministic and non deterministic algorithms then define p problem np problem class p problem class np np hard problem np complete problem so this was about the important questions which i have noted down by comparing the previous year paper and uh the 2021 paper and the previous year papers so all these notes uh, important questions everything would be available in the description in the g drive so you can go through the g drive and access the material and along with that each and every topic is covered in my youtube playlist so there are 25 videos here uh, i would say if you cover these 25 videos no you'll be thorough for the uh, ada exam and uh, yes you if you have any doubt do let me know in the comments and uh, stay tuned i'll be uploading important questions for other subjects also and uh, thank you